Another contentious exchange at a Savannah City Council meeting playing out in public. It happened during Thursday's meeting after a vote on a liquor license when one council member told another to shut up. What? Ladies you and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, shut up, Keisha. Ladies and Could gentlemen, move for a five minute recess, please. No, ma'am. No, sir. We, we, we're going to move on. Happening off camera during council meeting, it was Alderman Curtis Pertee who told Alderwoman Keisha Gibson Carter to shut up. Mayor Johnson, yes. I want to know if Mr. Party, did you just tell me to shut up? Um, I'm, I'm not going to respond to that. I ascribe to the notion that the lioness does not consider the thoughts of the gazelle. The exchange came after council voted to deny a liquor license to black business owners and after Alderwoman Gibson Carter expressed concerns about race. There's your rec racial equity what city what manager. Is, what does Thank race you. have anything to do with it? A whole lot. I don't see it. Well, you would Here in the city of Savannah, we have over 600 um, bar and liquor serving establishments and fewer than 20 of them are owned by African Americans. In a statement to News 3, Alderman Perti said this about Thursday's exchange, quote, while saying the word pedophile yesterday, she looked at me, which was offensive. Why? Because I'm gay? Because my partner is younger than me? Her actions are completely inappropriate and I had enough. You'll remember Alderman Pertee was one of several aldermen who filed an ethics complaint against Gibson Carter back in 2020. She says she does not plan to file an ethics complaint against him. She does say that while she doesn't want an apology from Pertee, he does owe an apology to every woman who looks like her.